I'm a freaky, freaky bitch. What's up guys, Freaky Gameplay Commentator here today, or the Hookah Review Commentator, and I'm here today to bring you another review on Fantasia's <gasps> Dragon's Breath. <gasps> Dragon's Breath. Let me bring it over to you guys real quick. Let me put macro mode on for you guys. Dragon's Breath. It is a dragon fruit, and I guess it's uh, from the rural Asia. The mysterious dragon fruit is believed to be the taboo, and many don't dare to touch it, let alone eat it. Oh god, why are we smoking it? Why are we smoking this? Alright, so you get it out of the box or the tin or whatever you get it in and it's very juicy like. Uh, I noticed in this one, I don't know if it was just because there was, it was like uh, packaged up and crumpled, but uh, they were, the tobacco was very together, the shisha, it was very together in there. So I don't know, it's still very nice. I like it, it's juicy and everything like that. Typical red Fantasia and uh, let's get to the smoking and the flavors. So as you guys know, I usually do a smell slash uh, taste test, but let's get onto the clouds first. The clouds right now I think are still getting heated up, so they'll probably get better throughout the video, and uh, let's get to them right now. The clouds are getting good. The clouds are getting good. They'll get better. Um, the smell of it, though, it's kind of like a candle again. It's like a really good candle. Like, if you went to a candle store and picked out a really good candle, that's probably what it was. But it smells like very fruity. It smells like a jungle fruit, like the dragon fruit. I don't know what the dragon fruit smells like, but this is probably what it smells like. Since no one will touch it and eat it, you know? I don't know, it smells, it smells very good. It smells really, really good. Like, not even kidding. Like, this is something like a candle could be smelled out of and it would smell fantastic. Uh, so the taste of it. The taste pretty much tastes exactly like how it smells. It's very fruity tasting. Um, it's not that strong. I don't know if it's just right now it's not that strong. Let's see if I can get a bigger hit. Yeah, it's very, very fruity tasting. Um, the, the, the rating of the smell is probably like a... Let's see. The rating of the taste, I should say, uh, is is like a seven out of ten. It's a seven out of ten. The strongness of the flavor. Um, I've smoked this a lot before. This is my, uh, I think, my first flavor I've ever smoked in hookah, and I really liked it because the buzz is really nice. Um, it's a buzz where you like just smile and just like, I don't know. It's just a really good buzz. I'm not getting a buzz right now so much, but then again, I don't know right now. So it smells and tastes pretty much similar. Um, I really like the flavor. This is one of my favorite flavors and uh, my first flavor I've ever smoked like I said before. And I'm smoking out of a Soul of the Lion Tricolor KM Water and Ice in the Vase Vortex Bowl 240mm Quick Lights of the Three Kings. Uh, they're pretty shitty quick lights. I don't recommend getting them. Uh, just because it makes some of the shisha taste like butt some of the time. I don't know if, there's, uh, if I put over too much heat on it. But the Vortex Bowl needs a little more heat on it to get it going, if you know what I mean. So, I really like the flavor. This is something you would smoke with your friends, definitely, because that's what I did. And uh, we were gaming and smoking, and this is such a good flavor to smoke. Um, it doesn't make your room smell like anything, really. Um, maybe like a candle. <laughs> like you lit a candle. Uh, but it's very fruity like, uh, the buzz is good, um, I haven't eaten today, so I'm not really getting a stomach ache from it, but I really like it, I, I really like it. So if you are in the Milwaukee area, Wisconsin, and uh, you know where Southridge Mall is, go to Sphinx, go get the tobacco, the shisha, and uh, tell them Tom sent you, 
and uh, Ed should be there, so he's awesome. And uh, I, that's where I get all my shisha from, so that's where I got it yesterday, and I picked it up, and I was like, bam, let's try some of this again. I haven't done a review on this, and I love this flavor. So, pick up Dragon's Breath. It is really good flavor to smoke with your friends. Really good try for it, uh, flavor to just try out, and, uh, you know, social smoke pretty much. It's very, it's very socialized. And a lot of people will like it. It's not something that uh, people, one person will hate it. it. It's a pretty good flavor. And uh, overall, uh, let's see, overall. Overall, I'd rate it like an 8.5 out of 10. It's not a really, really strong flavor, but not a really, really good flavor because it's not that strong of a flavor. Like you can't taste it that much because it's really smooth. It's a really smooth flavor. You could easily eat with this and uh, it's just really good flavor to uh, smoke with your friends. Uh, very smooth, like I said, no real bad head buzz. The buzz is really nice if you get it. And um, I really like the flavor. So 8 out of 10, or 8.5 out of 10 actually. Um, go pick it up either at uh, your local mall or if you're in the Wisconsin area, go to Sphinx. And if not, go to 5starhookah.com. And uh, I'm still trying to get sponsored by you guys. Uh, you guys said that you're already sponsoring someone, which I don't get. You guys can still sponsor me because I'm a freakster. And I do the best hookah reviews. And uh, I really like this flavor, as you guys know. And so, if you guys want to go pick it up, it is Dragon's Breath. Um, very nice flavor to smell out of the box, too. So you'll instantly smell it and be like, I want this flavor. Because that's what we did the first time. And I was like, yes. Yes, we are getting this. And uh, that is a really good flavor. And when I first got this flavor, I had a Dragon Hookah. So it, it fit perfectly with it. And it was like a little baby dragon hookah, like that tall, and it, it fit perfectly with it. And uh, yeah, so I really like the flavor. 8.5 out of 10. The clouds, uh, I think they need a little more heat for it to get a kickstart. Let me try getting thicker clouds for you guys. They're a little bit thicker now, but I really like the flavor. It's something you could definitely eat with. Won't stink your room up. <laughs> You'll smell like a candle in here. Uh, the clouds kind of drift around right now just because I don't have a breeze outside. And it's starting to get warm outside, so I'm pretty happy about that. And uh, I really like it. I really like the flavor. So if you want to go pick it up, Fantasia, Dragon's Breath. Uh, I got another 50 because, you know, I want to do a review on it. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this little hookah review on Dragon's Breath. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.